The Maltese Shih Tzu Mix is a designer hybrid dog also known as a Malshi. They are affectionate, loyal, brave, bold and confident companions. They have a good lifespan of 10 to 14 years, stand around 9 inches tall and weigh about 10 pounds. Their small size makes them great lap dogs and apartment pets. They will also be surprisingly good watchdogs. Maltese Shih Tzu puppies do best when given lots of attention, time and training. Before I move on with the video, do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that would help you have a well-behaved, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. This secret training technique, cheat sheet is available for free only for a limited time from the link in the description box below. Maltese Shih Tzu personality can be a little quirky, with cheeky behaviors such as yapping, digging and chewing. But thanks to its toy-like appearance, miniature size and perky personality, many feel this pocket rocket crossbreed would be the perfect little companion. Maltese Shih Tzu Appearance A Maoshi will be small, and will have a long, luxurious coat. There is a chance they will have some of the colors and markings of the Shih Tzu, so they might not be a white dog. The longer nose of the Maltese may negate some of the breathing issues that a pure Shih Tzu will experience too. As with any mixed breed, a Maoshi will inherit a combination of traits from both parents. This means that we can get a fair idea of how they may look by familiarizing ourselves with the parents. The Maltese is compact and balanced, and its big dark eyes and black dot for a nose make up a sweet, well-balanced face. Shih Tzu are compact and solid, and carry themselves with an air of arrogance. The Maltese stands between 7 to 9 inches, and weighs under 7 pounds. The Shih Tzu is also small, standing from 9 to 10 and a half inches and weighing from 9 to 16 pounds. The Maltese Shih Tzu as an adult will fall somewhere between the two. Grooming and Coat Care Maltese Shih Tzu mixes have silky hair which can be trimmed or left to grow long and flowing, depending on how much upkeep the owner is prepared for. They have a double coat, which grows long and luxurious when looked after properly. Their coat comes in a few color variations and markings, ranging from black, to liver, to red, to silver and quite a few shades in between. Maltese Shih Tzu Mix Temperament Both the Maltese and the Shih Tzu are bred to be companion dogs. As such, a mix is likely to produce a dog that bears the qualities of companion dogs. They will probably be friendly, loyal and outgoing. Neither of these dogs have the tendency to be aggressive. They are both known to be most interested in spending time with their human companion. Both breeds are playful, so you will have to keep them occupied with appropriate toys and games. Otherwise you could find some holes in your backyard, or some puddles in the living room. As they are so cute and playful, you may also need to keep an eye on children or other dogs during playtime. Training your Maltese Shih Tzu While both these dogs are eager to please their human family, the Shih Tzu is known to be a bit willful. So, while their size could lead you to believe training will be a breeze, you may need patience and persistence to train a Maoshi. As with any breed, it is important to train your dog using positive reinforcement. It is equally important that you socialize your dog as soon as possible. Socialization means exposing your dog to new people, dogs, environments, and situations, ideally from an early age. When done as a safe and positive environment, your pup learns that new or unfamiliar situations are nothing to be afraid of and learns to enjoy them. Maltese Shih Tzu Health Aside from the problems associated with brachycephaly in the Shih Tzu as discussed above, they are a healthy and long-lived breed. The Maltese also experiences generally good health and does not have breathing issues as it is not brachycephalic. Splitting the difference, you can expect that a Maoshi will have a long life. Be prepared to spend a little bit of time or money grooming a Maoshi, as their coat will grow long if left untrimmed. There is always the chance of foreign objects getting stuck in the fur if it is left untrimmed, which can lead to discomfort or infections. Be careful not to let your Maoshi grow too fat. Being companion dogs, they can become accustomed to being couch potatoes. Also, if your dog is brachycephalic, it is even more important that they do not become overweight, as this exacerbates the issue.
You can expect a Maltese to live from 12 to 15 years. A Shih Tzu will usually live from 10 to 18 years of age. Pros and Cons of Getting a Maltese Shih Tzu Cons 1. Possible issues associated with brachycephaly if this trait is inherited. 2. Grooming is required to keep the coat in good shape. 3. Care needs to be taken when playing with children or bigger dogs. Pros 1. Great for those with limited space. 2. Loyal and companionable, both breeds are keen to please. 3. While care should be taken not to let them become overweight, they don't require huge amounts of exercise. Do Maltese Shih Tzus make good family dogs? Temperament-wise, these dogs make great family pets, especially if you don't have much room. Bear in mind that you will have to be watchful if you have children or other dogs. If they play rough, a dog of such small size could get injured. If your Maoshi has a flat face, this will also limit how much physical exertion they can safely handle. While their coat is not completely low maintenance, a regular trim may be the easiest option. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel, Little Paws Training, if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.